What's up, gamers? It's your boy, Launchpad1412. Excited to be back with episode 3 of the Follow the Leader series. We are 2-0 at the moment. Last time we left off, we had the Vikings. Uh, I can't remember who we was facing, but we had the Vikings. And I know we did um, We did pretty good. We did pretty good <laughs> with the Vikings. Obviously, we did good since we won the game. But, but yeah, we got the build now. So, next game, we played the 49ers, my favorite team. I'm definitely looking forward to that. Now, hopefully we can get a dub in that game, and hopefully we can get a dub in this game and keep the streak undefeated. This guy I was going up against was pretty good. Look at that crazy interception right there. I low, I low key feel kind of bad for him because like these picks, <laughs> like he just snatched the ball. Like look, look at this, like he just snatched the ball like right out of his hand. Like I, I don't even, I don't know. Like you just, you just can't predict like that would happen. So, so it's just. Those are like some of the wildest, pick, wildest picks. I get that it's Shadavius White, but man, that is just, it's just a wild way to get picked off, man. Especially when you're at that point in, in the drive. But at any rate, we do have a playlist for the series. So check out the playlist if you miss a video. We have a playlist for all the series. And yeah, so go go check out those uh those playlists. You know, if you miss a game or you just want to check out the playlist. But anyway, right here we get the Stefan Diggs. <laughs> nice catch right there, getting all the way down to the two. A little friction right there with the freezing, but we don't get into the end zone. I don't know why we didn't even get in, but they gave us the, the six points. We're not going to argue about it. Look at this, man. Some more freezing. End up missing the field goal. And when I did the kickoff on this drive, it froze again. I'm like, man, you got to be kidding me. So this is why he's at the 43-yard uh, line, but... So I like how he, he, he used Trey Young. I keep forgetting that he's on the team. You know, sometimes. <laughs> like, when I use the 49 as of late, I've just been using, uh, I was going to say Joe Flacco for some reason, but Jimmy Garoppolo. I just been forgetting he's on the team. Good patience by my opponent right there. See, he didn't have nothing. And then, so he just took off and started running, got a couple yards. That's what you got to do. Like, if you really want to win in this game, you got to have some patience and you got to see what you got. Sometimes you got to take the sack. You know, it's just part of the game. <laughs> Man, that's how you got to take a sack. Just like real life. And then when you take a sack, you get down like 30 and 18. You know, instead of trying to go, you know, for eight or, or second and 18, rather. You know, instead of trying to go, you know, all the way. This is a good run. We didn't get to the touchdown, but this is a really good run right here. I thought we had it. This guy came out. I know sometimes these people. <laughs> I thought these people get speed. I'm like, yeah, that's that's McKenzie. Like, he's pretty fast. I'm thinking, like, who the heck is 31 that was fast enough to get out there? But anyway, but yeah, but let's say second and 18. And. You know, instead of trying to go get the whole thing in one in one play, you know, second and eighteen, try to get eight yards or ten yards or maybe even five yards, and then you got you know you got third and thirteen, which is a lot better than third and eighteen, or you got third and ten versus you know third and eighteen, you know, blah blah blah. But as you can see, we scored a touchdown right before the half. We up six, and we get the ball. I love getting the ball at half, man. It's just when you're playing these games and you know you're trying to win you're doing this and that it's the ultimate refresher man to get the ball especially when you win it pass your fate we go to the right here we go to the fullback probably one of the better fullbacks in the league as far as playing madden because he is really fast i don't know who he is um for some strange reason i don't, I don't know i guess because the bills don't use their fullback that much i guess <laughs> in real life so i don't i don't know who the guy is maybe if someone said his name i probably know who he is but at any rate we were forced to punt. I'm like, man, he got to be kidding me, man. At this point of the game, I don't really know how good my opponent is. You know, he, he seems like he's, he's pretty sound. But this guy is actually pretty good. He's one of the better opponents that I've played against, at least in my personal opinion. Opinion, You know, just just good patience, you know, with the offense, you know, making good decisions on a run and pass, um, understanding where to throw it, even though we do pick him off right there. But, you know, just because a person's like sound doesn't mean they can't get – uh, picked off, you know, people would say that I'm pretty good at the game to a degree. Um, not sure why. Not nah, kidding. <laughs> As we get a huge game right here. Well, I, I win most of my games, so I, I guess that you know solidifies me as a sound player or a pretty good player. Um, and I, I genuinely do think if we get the two point conversion, I genuinely do think if like, if I like play with like the Packers all year or maybe even the 49ers or the Bills all year, something like that. And just see like what my what my record would be. Look at this catch right here. I had to replay for the, this for y'all a couple of times. Replay. I had to replay <laughs> this for y'all a couple of times, man. Um, if that was just wow, third and like forever. And he ends up getting. I mean, it's my boy George Kittle, so I, I feel like. Um, I, I guess I'm like yeah, I guess. Um, <laughs> it's like it's like I'm kind of rooting for, it, but I'm not at the same time. <laughs> 
<laughs> it was like, okay, Kittle can do that. Okay. Uh, but, but yeah. Um, hey, what was I talking about? I can't remember what I was talking about. Well, at any rate. <laughs> Man, my opponent's coming down the field. First down the goal, goes over the middle and scores with the boy McCaffrey, man. They looking good in that 20, the, the number 23 jersey. I'm like, man, he killing me. But look at this, man. The boy, I don't know what it is, but Josh Allen, every now and then, man, he throws like some crazy balls. I threw this up. I didn't have to throw this up. I had somebody, the tight end open, but I just threw it up because he, he was an X Factor. I figured he had to double me. I don't know what his X Factor is, but I figured he had to double me. So I said, man, let me just throw it up, man, see if he, if he gets it. We ended up getting sacked on that fourth down and ten. That was not the best. Oh, oh yeah, this is what I was. Oh yeah, I was saying that. Um, you know, if I picked the basically, I'm saying if I picked the better upper echelon teams, um, my record would be much different. That's basically what I was trying to say. But anyway, twenty one to twenty one for all the marbles in China, man. We got to score on this drive. We really just need to touch. I mean, not touchdown, but a field goal. We just really just need a field goal. But a touchdown would be awesome. Twenty three seconds left. And we go to one of my favorite plays, and look at this. Your boy, Josh Allen, just overthrows him. Like, you got to be kidding me. Third down and seven. Let go. It's your boy. <laughs> yes, sir. <laughs> I mean, Allen gets the ball there late. I'm like, I don't know why he didn't have more. But McKenzie catches it over two people. This game is insane, man. This game, I don't even know how to, y'all, don't take this game serious. Look look at this, McKenzie, Lil Baham McKenzie caught that over two defenders for game. Unbelievable. Like, you gotta be kidding me. I'm the one that did it, and I'm telling you, you gotta be kidding me. That's a wild way to take an L, man. That's, <laughs> I can only imagine how he feel, man. The guy was pretty good, though. He was a pretty good opponent, man. But we go undefeated in this series. 3-0. We're going to take that. We're going to play the 49ers next. Follow the leader series. We got a playlist for it. I I, I just, I don't I don't know. I, I don't know, man. I don't know. I don't even know what to even say about that play. That was just, that was wild, man. I, I just, I don't know. <laughs> I'm low key kind of speechless, man, because I'm just like, I, I guess it's just one of those moments where you like, if, if if it happens to you, if it happens for you, you're happy. But if it happens against you, you like, you know what? If I gotta go out like that, it is what it is. I, I think that's one of those plays, man. Um, wow! Shout out to my opponent, man. Much love, much respect, man. Just, oh, but George, that George Kittle catch. I, I, I guess, they, I guess EA felt like they owed me that. That George Kittle catch was. <laughs> Off the chain, man. Isaiah McKenzie with the game-winning touchdown catch over two people in the back of the end zone with a bad boy, a slow ball thrown at him. EA Sports, it's in the game. <laughs>